And when talking about 19th century, I just want to show you the construction on this Windsor. There's a lot of different variations of Windsors out there, but I have an example here I want to show you today, which is the plank seat um, that you can see here with the rabbit ear, or they call it a thumbback ear, the thumbback or a rabbit ear. And on, um, on the sides, you can see the peg construction. It's really a little difficult because it's dark, but it's there. And you can see the stencil marking on the construction here with the spindles. And the spindles will come in a variety of different numbers. You can have here we have four, but they come in examples of five and six uh, larger. Some of the spindles will um, go all the way up. This one has an extra slat on the back side. And I want to show you on the construction here. You can see all the carving by hand, how uneven this carving is here. This is really typical of the 19th century chair. So, and you can see the wide, thick back on the plank seat, and the, uh, you'll see uh, four spindles, two higher on the sides and lower on the uh, front and the back. Um, this is a really typical example of a, a 19th century Windsor.